and hello and welcome back to Trails into Reverie. We are on dra uh, daydreams and raydreams and night dreams and mainly daydreams. Slab of so, reminiscence. Three activated. more to go. Rolling a D. Three. Go. One. A maiden's melancholy. Uh, I have no idea what this one will be about. It's an interesting set of, uh, it's an interesting group of people. Hmm. Definitely the, like, I guess they're all single? <laughs> Is that gonna be what it's about? I I'm trying to, th like, uh, the older... I bear many a sin upon my shoulders. Yeah, that that's definitely, this is about them all being single sort of way to start a, start a story. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> One is from realizing the great twilight, throwing the empire, no, all of Zemiria into chaos. One is watching Milliam sacrifice herself without so much as lifting a finger. One is using the talent His Excellency the late Chancellor found within me to avenge my father by my own hands. One is tearing my family apart. My crimes are numerous and eternal, and yet I am allowed to remain in the RMP like nothing has changed. Um... I guess the real connecting fabric between them, they all have sort of like a tragic, they failed someone sort of uh, backstory to them, right? That isn't because my sins have been forgiven. If nothing else, I refuse to forgive myself for them. A sinner should never expect to be forgiven. We have no such right. All I can do is resolve to rebuild the world that we had destroyed with my own two hands. That is all I am capable of. Hmm, that's fair. I, I, in, in defense of my, like, reaction of, like, how are these similar going to, like, uh, I guess they're single? Uh, elements... <laughs> uh, in defense of myself on that, I, I will say that Using the word maiden does imply a more lighthearted style. With more potentially romance. Uh, not that it's a good defense, but it is my defense at the moment. Uh, they'll let anybody on a train these days. Figures I'd get stuck riding with you. Wasn't the most joyous coincidence. You know as well as I do that it was no coincidence. You even brought lunch for me. I bet he just looked into what the guild was up to and took a guess that I'd be on this specific train. <laughs> Nothing passes your watchful eye, I see. I expected you would be tired after all your hard work across the land. Making you a meal was the least I could do. Well, I've got to admit, the sandwiches were exactly what I needed right now. In all seriousness, thanks for that. I'm glad to see your trip was uneventful. Welcome to Heimdall. I apologize for calling you both all the way here. How gracious of you to come and meet us. Gotta admit, I never expected you of all people to summon us here. Why do I get a feeling we're just wandered into some huge to-do list? <laughs> I wish I could say you're wrong. But first, would you care to join me for a little girl talk, shall we say? Okay. Maybe I was a little bit more justified. <laughs> Intruder alert! Intruder alert! Someone's got it in the building. They're having girl talk. They may have accessed confidential girl talk information. Apprehend them at once. I repeat. Why this have to happen while the Major is away? Find them, damn it. The intruder is using active camouflage. You'll need to use heat, movement, and other sensors to... Active camouflage. Interesting. We did just see what's-his-face. Ow! What are you doing? Get up. Did one of them just... I didn't do anything. It's like there's someone. Oh, yeah, we did just see that. Pardon me. I should have kept to the edges of the corridor. I wonder, I wonder if this is all setting up something for him specifically. 
And now we have two of these. I wonder if more of them are going to have this. I mean, we do have five in total. I cannot have you speak more of this. Now fall into a lengthy slumber. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna guess that these... And it might just be literally just him finding all his artifacts. Don't move. You're under arrest. Huh? Where'd he go? The optical sensor isn't picking up anything. How could he vanish so quickly? Well, he can't have gone far. Find them. Yes, sir. Hmm. Uh, it all transpired the other day at dawn while I was away. A record concerning a retrieval operation for weapons using crossbow during this past war was stolen. The motive for the data's theft is currently under investigation. Hmm. Sounds like someone's trying to stir up some trouble. They've got to have some stones to sneak into an RMP hub. An invisible man, huh? We haven't had any reports about it at the guild. I think it's, uh, I think it's the work of the fa uh, Phantom Thief? No, neither the target nor modus operandi matches Blue Bonk style. And there's no reason for the enforcers or Anguists to incite trouble in the capital at present. Which means all signs point to Hercules, the Republic's special forces unit. But there's no way the Republic would choose now of all times to come at the Empire. Precisely. Plus, the optical camouflage superb use is far more advanced than Ramda. Interesting. Good point. Ultra high grade stuff camouflage that makes short work of any and all sensors. Its very existence is puzzling, but it also implies that more classified documents are in peril. Or have already been stolen without anyone noticing. At least that's what we at the RMP surmise. So it's likely the purpose hiding somewhere in the capital. Well, that explains why you'd want our help, huh? <laughs> I'm glad you catch on quick. We both have strong familiarity with the good and bad sides of the coin. Making your perspectives invaluable. I understand you're both very busy, but might I request your assistance? Especially now that you've already come out here. Um, what to do? <laughs> oh, Lady Sarah. The fact that you came all the way out to the capital betrays your enthusiasm. Ah. I mean, everyone in Class 7 is working their butts off all around the country. This is as good a time as any for the Badass Babes Brigade to show what we're capable of. Needless to say, I will also assist. Lady Claire, the RMP works day in and day out for this country. I wish to ease that burden, if only a little. Thank you so much. I knew contacting you was the right choice. Oh, stop. I'm blushing. Uh, but you know, it's kind of sad. Three maidens sitting around midday talking about work. This is the girl talk, right? Uh, indeed, we could do with a little color in our lives. Prince Oliver and Lady Sherazar's wedding the other day was positively lovely. Yeah, wasn't it wonderful? Plus, I hear Fiona and Lieutenant Colonel Nightheart are getting along quite nicely. How are things going with you, Major? Any steamy tales, uh, tales of romance on your end? Well, um, I've been incredibly busy, so you know. Uh, speaking of which, I'd love nothing more than to get this investigation started as soon as possible. Oh, come on. Weren't you the one who called this girl talk? You're stuck with us until we're done with our tea. Uh-oh. Ooh. She does look vaguely familiar, but not enough for me to be like, I actually recognize that person. Hmm. After enjoying some lively conversation, discussions on the Invisible Man began anew. Working closely with the RMP as I surveyed the city, the work together I w uh, they worked together to gather eyewitness reports. Sarah also used her guild connections, allowing them to gather a wealth of rumors and information. Sharon then 
took all they learned into consideration to track down a suspicious trail leading down below. And in light of their findings, they're able, uh, all but convinced that the criminal they saw was hiding somewhere beneath the capital. Which is, you know, not a small task to search. So, every eyewitness report points to our guy hiding out underground. A pity that our findings have only expanded our investigation rather than narrowed it. In a way, yes, but it's a good thing that all eyewitness reports were in similar looking areas. I think if we can narrow down what made our culprit choose those areas, finding them should be easier. It also might be able to uh, distinguish an upcoming target or a trend of targets or... And then we can finally relax. So how about we... Well, this is a surprise. Is she a friend of yours? Nope. I thought she was talking to you. Um, have we met? Huh, so you don't recognize me? Well, makes sense in its own way. We haven't seen each other since our families parted ways. It's Isara. Isara Irving? Irving, 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 Irving. Uh, that sounds... Very familiar. Oh, okay. The ma like the um. Okay, yeah, I got it. It's her her family. The major is uh, named Irving. Gotcha. I didn't remember his name was Irving, but as soon as I saw his, like, art pop up when I looked up Irving, Trails of Cold Steel, it's like, oh, yeah, nope, I remember him. Same last name as the Major. Indeed, she must be related to the Tenacious. Uh, I'm so sorry. I honestly, I had no idea. You've really grown. Growth tends to happen over the years. I'm 23 now. And I've grown. So look at you. Nothing I've heard has done your pretty face justice. I bet Emil would be showing you off left and right with the pride, uh, with pride if he were still here. I, I must apologize, but I... Oh, no need to sound so stiff. We used to play together as kids. Next they're going to call me Miss Irving. Should I call you the Icy Maiden then? Heard that one in the papers. Must be so nice to trash the whole country and still be able to keep your uh, cushy job at the end of it, huh? Okay. Yeah, she, she let out the antagonism pretty quickly there. Hey, you can't say whatever you want just because she's your cousin. Stay out of this, old hag. What? I can't be older than you by more than a year or two. Please try to retain your composure. She also already said her age, so you'd know for sure. No comeback? Wow, getting old's really sucked the life out of you. Are any of them over 30 yet? I don't remember. Well, I'll be uh, getting back to work. I'll let you carry on with whatever it is you were doing. Sure hope it isn't anything that would make Emil feel more ashamed uh, than he probably is of you. Of course it isn't. I hope your work goes well. Take care. Walking alone can be dangerous. <laughs> yeah, you showed that it affected you, but you were able to stay above it. Bye. Uh, No amount of time will make my sins disappear. I thought I was well aware of that, but maybe I wasn't. They won't disappear, nor should they. I don't deserve the luxury of running. And though the woman continued their investigation for a while after that, they found no new leads. They then decided it was better to call it a day, and so with uh, Sarah inviting the other two for drinks, uh, dinner and drinks. Sar is that stubborn Michael's little sister, huh? Hmm. She's a business consultant. Yeah, seems like a capable young lady. She's a, She is. She's in demand all over the country, so she's always traveling. She's even doing business with the Revelt company. 
Something Michael will update me on and uh, how she's... Sometimes Michael will update me on how she's doing. She's grown so much. I've heard bits and pieces about your family situation. It seems rather complicated. And I don't remember it very clearly, I gotta be honest. I've heard a little about the company's woes myself. I'm the one who sentenced her father, my uncle, for his death, uh, for his crimes. Perhaps things didn't have to be that way, but it's a choice I made in the moment. My family collapsed like a house of cards afterwards. The company nearly crumbled into nothing. Okay, that gives me a lot more context. I should only follow that she despised me. Gotcha. You know, I was able to squeeze a visit to North Ambria recently after freeing up some time. I wanted to go pay my respects to my dad in well, the first time in a while, really. Oh. <laughs> I'm sure already more than aware, thanks to some file or whatever. I'm something of a disaster orphan. My dad found me and raised me. I'm sure he always struggled over his decision to raise me as a Jaeger. Ultimately, he gave his life to protect me. In his final moments, he told me to think about how to live my life. Yep. We weren't related by blood, but he still thought of me as his little girl up till he breathed his last breath. To me, that's more family than anything. I... I see. She's absolutely right. The Ryan family considers me family as well. Even when I try to sever those ties, they refuse to snap. Some bonds simply cannot be severed. Would you consider you and Lady Asar the same? I... I mean, to be fair, I totally get how a stubborn doofus like you would be too paralyzed with guilt to do much. But the next time we see her, look her in the eyes, talk to her. You can't move forward otherwise. You're right. In hindsight, I've been averting my eyes from everything since back then. From the company, from Michael, from Asara. The great twilight over the Empire is entering a new era. Maybe time for me to start anew as well. To face reality. It seems as perfect as time as any. And look, I'll give you as many folks and prods as you need. Call it a perk of being in the badass babes brigade. <laughs> Thank you. Both of you. So I was sort of right on both counts. Oh, hello. Hey, Major Irvin. Yeah, no, I, I saw him in the artwork. It's like, oh, yep, no, I remember him. He was the sort of kind of generic looking guy who was also a major character. <laughs> Claire, where are you? Uh, Michael, is something wrong? You sound... I need to hurry to the Leica district. Isar is in danger. Oh. What timing? Maybe associating with us put her in uh, as a target. Thank you so much, Lady Isar. Your business advice is greatly appreciated. On the contrary, Mr. President, I'm the one who should be grateful. By all rights, this company should have been, uh, should have gone bankrupt, but you built it, uh, built it back up practically from ruin. Mm. This company, it's important to me, to my brother, and to her. You seem rather forlorn, my lady. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Anyhow, until next time. But of course, I await your return. Oh boy, your skull's thicker than ever. Quit trying to shoulder everything yourself, you big dummy. You were really aggressive for someone taking that stance. Oh, that's gonna eat at me. I'm gonna talk to her again while we're both still in the capital. Um, well, it's a thought. It's a thought, 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 thought. Uh, it's gonna be I'm gonna talk to her again while we're still on the cap. Um, whoa, 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 shit, I lost my train of thought as I was thinking of it. Basically, I assume she, yeah, okay, yeah, she, she probably just saw it, like, lashed out a bit because she hasn't had the chance in a long time. Just like how... Claire 
also sort of reacted in a panic. Oh, I know. Michael's got to know her schedule. I think he still leaves. Hmm, he must be busy. That reminds me, you still need to wrap up talks before that thing uh, on the thing from before. Maybe he picks up, we can... Oh, great. Now it's raining. Lucky me. Rutro. Why would... Huh? Someone noticing... Oh, that's interesting. This will hardly do. It must not be waterproof. Leaving behind a witness is not ideal. It must not be waterproof? That's interesting. Yeah, witness. That's not what I thought might be happening. Hello? Sorry for being slow to pick up. You never call me this late. Is something wrong? Michael? Help me, Michael! Isara! What happened? I Isara, answer me! Isara! Isara. How could this have happened? I only just saw her off! The Invisible Man is behind it, then. Yep, we finally got a handle on this location. Also... I don't think... Is there a actually... A I don't think there's any evidence there to come to the conclusion that it's the Invisible Man. Like, she didn't say anything to be indicative of that, outside of it just being sort of random. It's not like the other guy was around to... It's hiding place through the museum and into the underground, right where the Dark Dragon was. I know the place was uh, to look into it more... I know the plan was to look into it more tomorrow, but I don't think we have the luxury of waiting. Agreed. And it'll take Michael some time to get here from Leaves. I'll let the RMP know so we can get to it. Sarah, Sharon, I'm counting on you both. Understood. Let's capture this mystery man and rescue ourselves a damsel. After hurriedly getting in touch with the director of the museum, they borrowed the key to access the underground and made their way down. Okay. Proper party. No healing station, which is sometimes yeah. indicative. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Is this is this just my TV? Oh my goodness, it actually is It's just really fucking Like, that, that looks like it's just a black screen behind her, right? The lighting in here. It's interesting how much better I can see the ground when I'm like... Either way. <laughs> like, I legitimately got turned around and I did not know where to go. Okay. Are you using her as bait now? Sorry. Watch out! Where'd that attack come from? Well, well, what masterful evasion. What's your percentage? 50? 60 percent? I did wonder who would dare be so bold as to follow me. You've done well to come. So you knew you were being tailed. So he was indeed using ultra-high-grade optical camouflage. We finally caught our invisible man breaking and entering into the RMP command center. No, that's hardly all. Hurt my family, and for that, you will pay. You're under arrest, you monster. Ah, oh my. How oh, very funny. But I shall play your game with the penalty. See if you can conquer one visible by the naked eye. Ooh, Ready. okay. Not actually that high. That's the best.
None of them are good at the moment. This is probably the best. Because it heals off that attack yes. and actually lasts enough turns that it might. Engaging! Spread out. Barrage. <laughs> Call in the shot. Uh, chance of burning, very, very, no, like chance of anything, very, very little. This one's on the house. I shall assist. Okay. Let's Here see I how go. weak. There. <laughs> Certainly. Here I go. Can you stand this? Toy Tiny Power! There it is. What? Ready. There! No. Now! This one's no. mine! Certainly. That actually would not be bad to get off by the end of this. Uh, break damage. I don't need break damage either. This is better though. Certainly. Like six, like five. Well, those are particularly good damage wise either. Interesting thought. Bring it on. Now. An opening. It's my sure. turn. So now. This Certainly. Now. This one's Bring it on. I got it. Certainly. A chance. This one's mine. Yes. A chance. This one's mine. I should have one more. I got it. This one's on the house! My boy! My reign is as the blade cuts! Eat the Certainly! I don't want to give the death blow. Arcus, activate! Yes! but oh well. Arcus activate. <laughs> Thanks. And we stand this. <laughs> Too bad. <laughs> yes. Uh... <laughs> You're so kind. Think you can beat me? I 
want to avoid using items if I can. What did they give me, anyway? A little bit. It's my turn. I'll sh yes. Okay, if I have that much wiggle room to get him still. Engaging! Mortal Barrage! <laughs> ah. <laughs> I shall assist. Arcus, activate! <laughs> Thanks. <gasps> I've got you! Bring it on. Oh, wow, that lack of movement. There it is. Yes. Engaging! Mortal Mirage! A chance! This one's mine! I shall assist. Arcus, activate! Call in the shots! Chance! Okay, I should be able to put the evasion back up now at least for the last little bit. The insight's still going, but the evasion should make it basically a sure thing relatively. Well, actually, that more than yes. anything makes it a sure thing. Never mind. No! It's <laughs> How could I... All that time building back up, trying to build back a BP. Battle complete. Good work, everyone. Yeah, that wasn't that wasn't a difficult challenge at all. I haven't restrained. Stop resisting and surrender. <laughs> My family wasn't thinking you were weak. It was still wires. I have a chance to survive of the Order of the Moonlight Horse. How do you know that name? I have, well, we shall say, something of a connection to them. Now I have completed my objective in this land, it's time I put an end to this game. Oh well, my fair ladies. May we meet again. Damn it! Sarah! He got away. Ah, how are things looking over there, Major? Okay, fortunately. Claire. Sara, thank goodness. How do you feel? I don't know what I would have done if something had happened. <laughs> you were always a softie when it came to family. Not that I'm one to talk. He... Completed his objective. My sins will never disappear. I committed them, and now I must shoulder them forever, even after the Empire begins anew. But I also need not shoulder them alone. I have friends and family who will share my burdens with me. That, at least, is something I can be proud of. Right, Emil? Uh, he is f completed his objective. Interesting. You have my thanks, Miss Valestine. In the Empire? In the Empire. Objective in this land. Interesting. He got information, then noped out of there. Okay. Honestly, the only thing I can think of is him collecting, like, his artifacts again for the stuff we saw. He said he got help from the Supreme Leader and whatnot, so it means they had to actually have been collected at some point. Both for helping with the RMP's investigation and saving my sister. I am greatly in your debt. Hey now, think nothing of it. We were all about helping out. Indeed. That Lady Asara is alright is enough of a reward in itself. I'm really sorry for kicking up so much of a fuss. As for you, Claire, I guess I owe you thanks. 
Even if you let the guy get away. Isara, there's no need. It's okay. What she's saying is true. What the culprit said has given us much cause for concern. Yeah, as the older gen of the group here, we're going to need to step up our game. If anything else happens, don't hesitate to call me. I'll be there in a flash. Thank you. I will be sure to take you up on that. Well, at least you're not as much of a lost cause as you used to be. You're no longer the dolt who bottles everything up and leaves the rest of us to figure you out. And I am a little bugged that I wasn't part of you finally letting down those walls. I'd like to believe that I've changed, yes. A little. I've met a lot of people in just a few short years, like the ones at Thor's who've been an incredible influence on me. But I still have so much further to go, and so much more I can prove to you. So I'll do all that I can to be a person you're both proud to call family, for you and for Emil. Sure, whatever. You get to that. All the best, Claire. Yeah, all the best. Well, at least the antagonism feels like it's an act now. <laughs> so, uh... I was thinking about it, and... I'm going to take you up on your offer after all. Well, that was sudden. Are you sure? I realize that we are the ones asking you to come, but it's not going to be an easy job. Oh, I know. Suffice it to say that the words has piqued my interest now that I've seen how much it's changed Claire. Oh, she can become a new teacher there. Oh, that would be cool. <sighs> so it has. I mean, if she's like a like a successful business consultant, that would certainly give her an expertise to teach at least some classes there. Okay, that's cool. Regan life. There's RMP. Yeah. I didn't have that yet. Okay. I didn't even think about checking for that. Hmm. Regan life. Regan leaf. Regan something. A salt cage regenerates on field. Increases the salt cage when damaged. Ooh, this actually sounds really good for like putting on someone I don't have any other like notable plans for. Just being like a passenger. Hmm. It's sort of a shame that the top one is on field. Ooh. That's actually pretty cool, I think. That's actually really cool. That could be really good. I don't know who I'd want to put it on at the moment. I do feel like I might, before getting back into it, go set up like Randy and Noel. And I didn't have a particular plan for Noel because I did actually move her off of her. Uh, Cause she had yeah, Aegis before. So that might be a good thing. That might be a good path for me to take with her. Hmm. Thoughts, thoughts, thoughts. I think I have time to do a trial, too. Trials available. So both of these I set up as heavy art attackers without any intention of planning to fight the trial with these two in mind. I'm curious who they'll go up against, but... That's an interesting choice. But also very scary. This woman's got some kind of hotshot. Uh, this woman's some kind of hotshot general in the Imperial Army, isn't she? She's just standing there, waiting patiently. And yet she already feels so threatening. Neither of these are going to live against her s so I. Mm. And she already feels so threatening. Right, that's General Ariella Gwyn, also known as the Golden Rakshasa. She's one of my most trusted commanders, which makes her all the more dangerous to personally confront in battle. If we're to have any hope of beating her, uh, someone of her caliber, we can't take her head on. Meaning, we've got to come up with a plan, and fast. Okay, so it's these two are together because they're the strategist sort of characters. Good thing we're two gals know our way around a scheme or three. 
precisely. That's just what I was thinking. What do you say we show the general just what we're capable of when we work together? Sounds good to me. What a passion Ooh, that's a good point. I don't think no matter how I... No matter how I set them up, neither of them are going to be tank or physically bulky in any capacity. Ah, uh, petrified, eh? That's not scary at all. Are there orders again? EP down, EP down. Oh. Arcus, activate. Go! I'm here. Arcus, activate. Yeah, I'm so good at strategy. So good at strategy. Oh my goodness, what do I even do about that? Hmm. <laughs> That's door actually presented. a really tricky. That's a really tricky proposition. The, the, her giving a zero craft and how shall we play? All that fun stuff definitely didn't Here to help. play. It's me. I love you. It's my turn. Arcus, activate. It's my turn. How shall we play? Okay, let's see if this is... She didn't use her S-Craft. 
Okay. She it's didn't my use turn. her S craft. Oh my goodness, this might actually work. Yay! I love you. This might Here's actually play. work if she doesn't use her freaking S craft. Because she already used her thing and she went through all those turns without using her S craft. I don't want to get healed, mainly. I'm here! Arcus! It's me! Okay! Uh, Continue on. Yeah! I'm here! Shall we play? Welcome! Yeah, I thought that might break. It's my turn! Arcus, activate! I'm here! Arcus, activate! It's my turn. Suddenly I feel more in danger. Suddenly I feel more in danger. Yeah, I'm a little bit... There it is. Okay. How dead am I? Dead everyone? Did I spread them out enough? Yep, it's both of them. Okay, so if this doesn't work, then I have to go use Adamant Shield, basically. Nurse Nadia's here. Or... What happened there? My next move What happened? Be why did nothing happen? Why did nothing happen there? I don't understand why nothing happened there. Huh? It's uh, me. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. I guess. Huh? Yeah. I feel like something similar happened earlier, where nothing, no damage was hit, was done it's my turn. when it probably should have been. So. Uh... Arcus, activate! Here to play! I, I want to use the weaker attack while she's still in this form, so I'm not it's using too turn. much EP while she has a bunch of extra ah. measures going on. Ah. 
frozen. It's me. Gotcha. Marcus. Here to play. Okay. This should help a lot. Speed up. Which is better? <laughs> Probably that. Here to play. Arcus, activate. It's me. Arcus, activate. Close she is. Pretty close. It's my turn. She's probably gonna use it again, which means definitely wanna do everything I can to So this ha! probably is going to be enough. Ha! Yeah, thirteen thousand. I've got a chilling spell for you. Well, I feel like I need to go funny. back and look at what happened on that S craft that one of them took Brilliant. no damage. Shot. And the other uh didn't die, but probably should have. Oh my goodness, did that hurt? I mean, it's not a complicated strategy, <laughs> but work, just should have used S crafts more often. I don't have anything. Oh, oh, did I have like a proxy puppet on? No, I didn't because it would have it would have broken the first time. Ooh, super naughty special. Interesting. I didn't have anything like special on them that would. Absorb's magical attack isn't the same as, and it was her that nothing happened to. So I use this, but also, it's not like it left a status. This is just 200. I oh maybe that was the real reason why, because it was 200% HP recovery, so there's enough health to live past it. You know what? That actually probably makes sense. I put 200% health, so the reason she was still at full health is because she was still technically above her max after taking it. While, in contrast, Muse was... Yeah, because she was at like 24,000, so she was still above her max even at the end. So, in contrast, Muse, uh, Muse was... May, I don't know if she, she was low enough, at least, so that it went back into her normal stuff. So that actually probably was the difference, the Grail Thalys. That actually probably was the difference because of the 200%. Okay! Go go, accidental strategy. <laughs> See, I had originally set that up with the idea that maybe one of them would live through an S-Craft. She didn't use the S-Craft and then just sort of like sat there for the rest of the time. So, yay! <laughs> uh, I was hoping her S-Craft wasn't full, uh, full thing, but that worked. Accidentally. I, I love how it was accidental. That's actually just sort of straight up hilarious. Either way, I think that's probably a good place to end for the day. So I'll see you all next time. Drive safely, everyone. <laughs>